<laughs> oh. <laughs> Today we're gonna be going into the back rooms. But we're doing it together, so it's fine. Boy, you better get that out of here on three. One, two, three. Boy, you bit it. Got that out of here. Everybody just do it now. Click the subscribe button in three seconds. Go, go, go. Three, two, click it. One, zero. Did you do it? Okay, all right, all right, we're good, we're good. In the back rooms, you better hope you have a cell phone, man. So comment down below what kind of phone you have. Do you have an iPhone 14? Do you have an Android? Or are you still rocking the iPhone 7? Let me know. And let's go! Um. I don't think a crowbar is gonna do much. You need more than that. You need, you need a, you need a, a, a Glock or something. Just back away, baby. That's the best thing you could have done. Just back away slowly. Okay, forget slowly. Run, man! There you go, you're free. I thought you were free, man. You were doing so good. That sucks. I thought you were home free. You didn't even use the crowbar. You could have at least tried to beat him in the face. Poke his eye out. Something, man. Don't just get got like that. That thing said, uh, tag, you're it. Cheese. Doppelganger is a German word meaning double taker. In the world of paranormal, a doppelganger is often portrayed as a ghostly or paranormal phenomenon. A doppelganger is like your evil twin. It is a sinister or evil entity out to get you. Others believe that doppelgangers are a form of demons. Hence why it's said to be bad luck if you see your doppelganger. Girl, you better get a refund on that mirror. I mean, are you serious? You turn around to take a photo and that demon's behind you making that face? Now that's a photo bomb right there. I mean, jeez. Girl, quit opening your mouth like that. You didn't use mouthwash. You didn't brush your teeth. You didn't do squat. Girl got her mouth open like she hungry. Psh, my doppelganger better not show up. I'll knock him out real quick. Slap him in the face with a mirror. Um. Oh. Wait. Yeah, let it move. God damn it. I'm so stupid. Uh, close the lights, close the lights, close the lights. Don't um, turn the lights off, you dumbo. This thing has. God, it broke through my. Oh, no. Oh, you're done. Ah! <laughs> let me, let me, let me. Go! God, it's. Let me in, let me in. You need to get a car. Ain't no way. Oh, oh you dumbo! Run! Okay. No. You're Just lucky man. your house has so many vents. That thing says, surprise, I found you. <laughs> no, it's time to go. You guys need a better security system, better alarm system. Like, come on. I didn't hear the alarm go off or nothing when that thing broke into your house. Sirens should have been going, like the fire department should have showed up. You need to set some booby traps, man. Lay down some proximity mines. Got to do something, man. Lay down some gasoline and then light that thing on fire. I genuinely do not even care if this video does well. Can someone please just explain to me what these things are? If you Your mama. tag a scientist or if you are a scientist, could you please weigh in here and just explain this to me? So if you look at these videos of them, they're just these long-legged white creatures. They're only captured at night on like garage camera footage, but they don't have extremities like a head or arms. But what freaks me out is that they're so consistent. All of these videos that come out of these, they all look the same. They're from different locations, but they're all kind of in the California area. Like, what? what is that? What is that? Okay, like keep your eyes over to the right hand side of this video. Look in the dark corner. Ugh. Look at that. Like what? There's no way that that's... F look at it again, magnified. Do you see that? Ugh. Who's faking that? What? The only contextual tie-in that I found are these Native American carvings that do kind of show creatures that look like these, but these sculptures don't really have a lot of historical context to them, so I'm, I'm begging you for rational explanations here. Please, somebody weigh in. Tell me what these things are. I don't know, man. Why don't you Google it? Them things are looking like some walking wishbones. Not today. You're not gonna come around me, not around my neighborhood. I'm gonna get all the gangsters, and we gonna roll up on you and take you out real quick. Oh, it's gonna be quiet. 
Imagine if we got like all the gangsters versus all the demons. <laughs> I mean, geez. Comment down below, who do you think will win? All the gangsters or all the demons? I put my money on the gangsters, all right? I put money on the gangsters. Ah! What are you? Um, their eyes follow you. Nope, we good, man. No, no. You know what? I think, uh, yeah, uh, somebody's calling me. Oh, man, I, I gotta go. I'm sorry, y'all. I'd, I'd love to stay, but uh, I gotta go. Whose basement is this? Jeez, whoever it is, man, bro, you need to be medicated. Drug tested immediately. You got these demon dolls whose eyes follow you wherever you go. Why? It's not even Halloween, man, and you doing this right now? I mean, it's got that Halloween shirt, but, you know. I don't know, maybe it was Halloween. You know what's gonna be? A massacre when I... Take all them dolls out. Brrr. Took your mom out to dinner. Okay, all right. Have you ever played this terrifying sleepover game? No. It starts like this. You and your friend must write down your name, first, middle, last, on a piece of paper, and then prick your finger and dot the piece of paper. Then you have to go around your entire house, turning off every light and every electronic. Then you have to stand in front of a closed wooden door and put the piece of paper down in front of it. Then you must also light a candle and place it on top of the paper. You need to knock on the door 22 times with the last knock falling at midnight and then blow out the candle. And then you've summoned the Midnight Man. There's not much known about the Midnight Man and the only instruction is to not allow yourself to be caught. What? Is that the Midnight Man or is that Slender Man? Is it Slender Man's brother? Like, 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 uh, girl, uh, I need a little bit more details. All you have to do is allow yourself to not get caught, uh, by Stretch Armstrong over here. Look at them arms. That thing could catch you from 20 miles away. Is he fast? Is he like one of those like fast running zombies from World War Z? Like, I, I don't know. Or is he like slow and we have time to like, we could just walk away. Homeboy got no face, man. I can't tell if he's sad, happy, or, or excited to see me. Always check your closet. No. I ain't checking squat. I don't even check my prostate. <gasps> oh! Uh, sir? J j just don't do it. Just, just don't do it. You don't have to go in there. Oh, girl, you scary. You scary, scary. I don't even think that was a demon. I think that's just an ex-girlfriend coming out to ask if we could get back together. Uh, no thanks. Sorry, uh, it's not you. It's, it's... Okay, it's you. You're always creeping around and like you, you don't say a word. I don't know how else to say it, girl, but uh, you need to see a psychologist. You need to take your medicine, all right? Uh, take your pills. Most Scary Urban Legends, part six. This is Krasu. The She's a Thailand legend. She's a female spirit who wanders the fields at night. At first, you would just see her face until you look down and she has no body Ew. and just her internal organs. Her guts are usually covered with fresh red blood. Her face appears to look somewhat like a vampire's. She has very sharp teeth and sometimes has a blue halo around her head. She is always hungry for meat, whether that be animal meat or human meat. Before she goes hunting, she hides her headless body somewhere safe and she needs to come back to it before sunrise. And then she becomes a normal person again for the day with no differences from anybody else. One of her origins was that she was a princess who was forced to marry a high-ranked Seminese member who killed her people in battle. But she loved somebody else and was caught with them by the Seminese member. She was then sentenced to be burned alive. She then asked the witch for help, who summoned a spell on her immune to fire. But the spell worked too late and everything was burned besides her internal organs and head. Uh, well, good night. Sleep tight and uh, don't let this girl bite. He says she likes to eat meat. Does she like dark meat or white meat? Hopefully white meat. That way, you know, I'm, I, I'm off the table. I'm off the hook. Scary videos found on the dark web, okay. The end of the world? Jeez. <gasps> Witch caught on camera. Um, why do you have to brush your hair like that, girl? Mm-mm, nope. Ah! <laughs> I gotta go, dog. 
got to go. That's the face my girlfriend makes when she's hungry. Really, you just had to switch up and transform like that? Like, like, come on, girl. Just say what you want. You don't have to make these war cries and freak out every time there's a Harry Styles concert. Jeez, this girl has no manners. You really expect your boyfriend to take you to meet their parents? I mean, it ain't gonna happen. Not if you can't behave yourself. I mean, jeez. Behave with your mama? Okay, all right, anyway. But if you enjoyed this video, then go ahead and smack that like button. And yeah, I'ma see ya in the next one.